Yo, what up? So today I just kind of wanted to talk about um, something that I think a lot of people are confused about, um, which is the connection between the Freemasons and the Illuminati. Um, people have asked me, like, oh, why would they clone you? Or a common comment is, wow, Carly, I am very confused about what's going on. She finds this so funny, doesn't she? Huh? Come on. Oh, man, this is going to be classic. Yeah, I, I understand that. So, let me tell you about Freemasonry, first of all. Uh, there are multiple degrees, of course, and you start out at the bottom and work your way up to, like, the 33rd. So, it's at the 13th level that um, it's revealed that they've been worshipping Lucifer. I'm just going to sit on this step here. It was kind of a mistake coming here today. There's a lot of people. But anyways, so the 13th degree, that's when it's revealed that they've been worshipping Lucifer, and that's what they do. Um, Freemasonry is a Luciferian doctrine. It's a pedivore cult, and basically at the 32nd degree, they find out, it's revealed to them, all of the information surrounding the cloning centers. This is where people will, you, maybe you've heard of this, where um, they'll do magic to bring someone back from the dead. It, no, it's the cloning centers. And all of the technology surrounding that. Um, at the 33rd degree, it's revealed to the, um, the person who's trying to crawl up the ranks in Freemasonry um, that the Vril exists. And, uh, there you go. That's all you need to know about Freemasonry. And, of course, they do the... She's unbelievable, right? Unbelievable. Well, what's this? Oh, uh, look at that. Unbelievable. Really? Oh, my God. Just can't... You know, I, I don't think I've seen a video that this, this woman has made where she hasn't forgotten her lines. It's unbelievable, you know, it's unbelievable. I'm going to meet her boyfriend in a minute on a different tape. It's unbelievable. I, just, I you know, you, ah. oh my God. Um, the satanic ritual abuse. There's a lot of people driving around up here today. Dang it. Come on, give us another laugh. So that's how Freemasonry and the Illuminati are connected, and, um, you know, certain individuals who reach the really high ranks of Freemasonry get to go to the cloning center with maybe their wife or what have you to basically do whatever they want and be as sadistic and disgusting as they want to um, their relatives that they have incestual tendencies towards, which is disgusting, but um, it's it's really rampant at the cloning center. And, uh, the reason why the Illuminati was interested, and still is to this day, in me, in my brain, um, they have all of the technology to just determine what kind of person you are, and your mental capabilities, your strengths, your weaknesses, and um, I just happen to be one of those people. There's an entire group of us at uh, the cloning center, like a little family. The bugs over here. It was a fly, and you know what flies are attracted to, right? <laughs> Piles of it. If any of these people actually sound believable. I don't think they do, but that's just an opinion. Let's meet her boyfriend, because she leaves the link to her boyfriend. Hmm? It's unbelievable. Instagram, MK Ultra is pure evil. Where, when you click, this is why they're all connected. When you click on this guy, he saves their videos. Just so they keep them all, and we'll we'll meet Becky Pierce. One of her videos. That's a beaut, right? 
we go down to here she says right here a bit more information regarding this. please check out my boyfriend's videos too right here bang oh that's great yeah uh, let's meet him now let's go let's see right here so he starts out with 89 subscribers let's see where he ends up in a month or two I'm sure he'll be up to 14, 15, 20 million thousand or some fucking ridiculous number. But at any rate, here we go. Oh, Ooh, Marty leads. Nah, 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 nah. Hey, yeah. Uh, I've seen my boy Marty leads. <laughs> my boy, oi, 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 oi. I've seen him in a live stream once, live chat. And the people I've seen in England, come and meet me, Marty. I live there and I live here. And they meet. They, they said they actually met at a bar. I wouldn't doubt it either. They're all puppets. All puppets. Okay. Hi. Uh, <coughs> sorry about the dogs. <laughs> Jeez, I want to. You know, now this is Kali Noel's boyfriend. I wonder if he can rem remember his lines. Hey, be quiet. the dogs barking in my mind <laughs> um but basically i had like a five point thing here that i wanted to show everybody bet you did um oh yeah look at that also i'm gonna draw something out british quick, empire so everybody can see exactly what i'm talking about visually so that i don't have to explain it and they have to visualize it I'll make separate videos, then again, I would only be rehashing what other people have already said and, you know, talked about online. Okay, so you see this? This right here? This is what is known as gematria, okay? Um, basically, it's just so everybody can write it down, everybody will see. It's A through M, and then N through Z, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And this right here is what you would call the Jewish menorah. And the menorah is, if you were to draw the other half, would be the three concentric rings that make up the man aura. This inner circle here is the past that's inside you, that's your core. This one here is the present moment, and this one here is the future, or, you know, the outer field. And... So, the, the goal of this video is to illuminate the connection between Freemasonry and the Illuminati. Now, these two things are connected. Basic, basically, the Illuminati is different groups of people that are all um, sort of coalesced into this one central secret society, but it's made up of Freemasons... Um, Rosicrucians, Scientologists, the Vril Society, the Black Sun uh, Society, the Golden Sun Society, the uh, like Order Templi Orientis, the the Priory of Sion, uh, the Pythagoreans, uh, um, the Luciferians, the the Satanists. Like it's basically just the what what the Illuminati is is basically an idea. That represents um, people who are illuminated and light and their manipulation of the understanding of light. Jesus Christ. All right, so this guy is the green goat. This is Kali Franz's boyfriend. I think this is, he's also this person here, Matthew Duke. He replies on a lot of different sites. Right? Yeah, he does. Yeah, let's go to Matthew Duke. The Green Goat. Now, when I clicked on that, see that? The Green Goat came up. How the fuck they're doing that? See, they're just being out there. They're allowing them to do a lot of different things now. You know that? To use a different name. Which is quite insane. So let's try this. Is like kind of All right, central. calm down. You ain't not here to really listen to you. Let me see that. 
Duke, Duke, Duke. Da, 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 da. We try that. Instagram page he says to go to. Right? There you go. Instagram, right? But you can watch out for this name. Matthew Carl Duke. Carl Duke. Matthew Duke. Right? And you'll see that he makes comments in a lot of different sites. And I'll tell you something else. Very rarely do you see a negative comment on any of these sites. They delete them right away. They delete them right away. I went all the way down to this guy. Right? Chill out, bro. Now this guy don't even say anything bad. Nick Tesla. <laughs> really doesn't. But he does question it, and uh, they don't want you to even quite, they just want you to, you know, type in, love you, feel so sorry for everything, it's, I hope you can get on with your life, I hope we can put these bad people away, and, you know, all this other shit that they say, but they're all full of shit. Anyways, make up your own mind, maybe you won't think that, I don't know, update, let's, uh, let's go to Becky on this one. See, and there, and there's these stories. I mean, this is like really kind of crazy, right? Whew. Another girl right here. This is another SRA. Now, this video is on this person's site. MK Alter is pure evil because it's not on her page. Once I found her page, this video was no longer on her page, right? It was it was removed. Um, in 2012, was it 2000? Yeah, in 2012, um, Anne had a baby, a baby girl. She kept the pregnancy a secret, and she had a baby girl. Um, they kept... She said Anne had a baby girl. We got all look at up oh, to Anne, the woman that abused me. You know, you go through this. You, it'll just blow your mind. I looked into. And I and I had a question when I was watching it. Like, well, did you tell the police? Did you go to authorities and say this is where a little baby is buried? I buried it there myself. Of course not. In a room in the house. And trust me, I wanted to tell people. Good I guy, wanted huh? to tell people that there was a baby in that room, in that house, that was being harmed, but I couldn't. They told me that they'd kill her, and I couldn't have that. I knew they would. I knew they'd kill her. Um, so... I went there more or less every day. Every chance that I got, I went to Anne's house and I fed the baby. We, I called her Lily. Anne called her It. She didn't have a name, so I called her Lily. And I'm not going to go into detail about this because it's still really painful, but in 2014, they killed her. Because I, I went into the room and I saw she was badly beaten. She had broken, she had broken bones, and I tried to take her out the house, and I, I wasn't fast enough, so I killed her. <coughs> and <coughs> they're such sick people. Come on, give me a chair. They chopped her body up, and they, they chopped her body up, and they um, made me dig holes for her body. And I never told anyone about this until this year. This year was the first time that I've ever told anyone that Lily even existed. Um, but I'm trusting God that her body or whatever will be found one of these days. And 
I know that she's in heaven with God now, and I just, I just can't imagine how much fun she's having. She's safe, and that brings me peace. It really brings me peace. Um, but those same woods, well, it was a field next to the woods that her body is, um, is buried. There was woods right next to those, that field. And while I was in Charlie's house, this is a, another thing that I just started to remember. Um, Hi guys, I hope you're all doing okay. Yeah, you just keep smiling, huh? I can't even keep watching these people, they're crazy. Let's see. Um, if there's any updates with my case, there's not. The Ninth Circuit hasn't come back yet with any news, so no news at this point is good news. So I... I guess she has a case in the Ninth Circuit. You know what? And some people commented on her accent, right? We'll go for that. The English. And then I wanted to let you know about um, my business. I know I've mentioned it a few times in the past, um, but I just wanted to let you know that it's still up and running. I'm going to put all the links down below to everything that I mentioned in this video. Okay. A new petition. This time I don't believe that there is a time to limit to get my goal signatures. Jesus. <sighs> and one guy does say something, I believe. <laughs> this guy right here. That's crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure that'll be deleted. <laughs> That's funny. Oh my god. <laughs> Jack again. Jesus Christ. Anyways. Make up your own mind if you believe her. Oh, what's this? Oh, 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 oh. And let's not forget Katie Groves. I'm sure that you guys can hear the sounds of wailing and sobbing in the background. That is my boyfriend who is in the hospital right now. I'm not sure where to even start with what's going on. I recognize that I am also revealing my location, I believe, by doing this. Um, so for multiple safety reasons. I I'll put the link to this too. I don't want, I can't, I already listened to it once, it's, re, you know, it's ridiculous, it is, honestly. This anymore, although I was able to still make a community post, um, multiple videos of mine appear to have been deleted in, I don't know, the last couple of hours, I think a part of me noticed it before, but I didn't notice it until just now, the most recent video of mine that I can see, um, is deprogrammed. Delta Alters Speed Part 3, I believe, um, which is not my most recent video. I've posted several videos since. Um, I don't really know what I'm asking you guys for. I just want you all to know that this is what is going on. And um, if I'm not able to continue speaking out on YouTube, I will join another platform. I don't know much about other platforms, but um, I might have an email. <laughs> it's slipping out that little smile. <laughs> Come on, huh? She can't be in the United States because that's not how they do it. Oh my god, my boyfriend is on the ground right now. If I felt I could do anything for him right now, I would be. I feel that what I'm doing right now is the best that I can do. Someone has asked why his methadone has been stopped. He's trying to get off of it. He has been um, in and out of recovery for over 20 years now, and um, he's trying to get off of opiates completely. Um, 
as long as I've been with him, he has not been an active addict as far as I am con concerned, but he has been taking methadone. Um, like I said, I'm very suspicious about what is causing his precipitated withdrawals. Um, and do not believe that it is because of anything that he has done that I don't know about. Um, I want you guys to share my videos as much as possible. Um, those of you who have downloaded my most recent videos, please share those. Um, use other platforms than YouTube. If you want to use YouTube, you can. That might reach more people. But at the same time, it seems like I really am probably being shut down on here. So, um, you guys, just please look out for my name. Um, Katie Groves, I will be... Yeah, we'll come back. Uh, made videos on how many subs. Look, she's up to 17,000. My God, like that's true. Yeah, Katie removes all of them, any negative. If she removes the comment, then bans you. Making sure to stay active online, and if you guys do not see anything from me online on any websites, then that means that I am being totally like shadow banned. Um, because I will not stay silent. Okay, I'm going to go now and try to help my boyfriend here. Thank you guys so much um, for all of your support, and I will keep trying to speak out, and I will probably... Yeah, I know. Of course, that's not how it's done. A traumatic experience I had while I was in the hospital with my boyfriend, where um, somebody who... Is very triggering for me and who I suspect I have a trauma history with that I'm unaware of showed up briefly to the hospital. Um, they are somebody who works in the medical field and um, I didn't actually talk to them but I saw them there. Um, they, I caught them out of the corner of my eye staring me down as I walked into um, the room my boyfriend was in after I had stepped outside to make outside of the room to make a phone call um, and um, I'm having a lot of flashbacks to things with this person that I didn't even know happened. So um, that's going to be very painful and difficult for me. Um, some parts have come up saying that they think that we actually may um, know this person from, um, from Texas. So this may not be someone that I have um, had um, more trauma with than I am aware of here where I'm living now. But I think this may be somebody that I actually knew from the cult when I was growing up, and so this is going to be a challenging thing for me to deal with, um, knowing that they're in the area I'm in is very frightening for me. Um, but um, Jesus. I also want to say I'm not sure if they officially work at the hospital that I um, was in, so I'm not necessarily making any claims about someone who's employed at the hospital that I named in my live stream, and I just want to make that clear for legal reasons. Um, this doesn't necessarily have to do with the hospital that I mentioned explicitly. Okay. Um, I don't know. You didn't mention any hospital. Yeah. All right. They're all psychos. Look at them. They're all psychos. Well, we're going to leave all the links to the psychos. And you'll all be fine. It'll be okay. Yeah, it'll all be okay. Mm-hmm.